holiday Monday in the UK. I am streaming today. Usually it's my day off, but why not? Why bloody not? Uh, new game. <clears throat> I got this yesterday. This is actually on sale in the PlayStation Store. I think I paid like £13 and it should have been 20 so it wasn't too bad, and I actually got DLC with it too. So uh, I thought I'd give it a go. I'm not usually into fishing <laughs> in like Dreamlight Valley and stuff. I'm not really much of a fisherman, but this looked interesting. It looks like, um, not that I've seen any videos, but it, it looks like you just fish and you upgrade your boat and stuff, and then you get more fish and there's story as well, which is nice. I'm hoping that there's voice acting, but I doubt if there will be. I will probably have to read it. Hey Poppins, how's it going love? You alright? So we're going to try a fishing game today. I am early by two minutes. What are you up to Poppins? How was yesterday? Hopefully you didn't get rained on. Not holiday, no, no, no Karen. Bank holiday, bank holiday today. So no one's at work. It's another bank holiday that we've got. This is the last one until August anyway in the UK, I think. I don't think we get any in June or July, just August. <clears throat> so I'm going to be streaming today this game. Like I said, it was on sale. I think it went from like 23 quid down to 12. And I also got DLC with it as well for like a couple of quid extra. Did you catch a, a, a tan, Poppins, at all? Did you get any sun? Oh, have you? you got to wait all the way till Christmas. I think we've got one in August, but I don't know what it's for. Nice. It's always good to catch up with a little tan. Is anyone aware of this game? <clears throat> I've always seen it, um, but I never wanted to pay the price. And now it's down and cheaper. I thought I'm going to have to. And then I watched a little bit of a video, and it didn't show any of the gameplay at all. Just that he was getting more fish and getting more money. Is it any good, Poppins? Is there anything you want to tell me before I start? Any tips? Is it good? Is there voice acting? Those are the three questions. Will I be okay? There's a fourth for you. It does look... Uh, it does not look. It sounds good. Because there's story and mystique and intrigue as well. Not just fishing. It was really good to watch. I watched it quite a long time ago though. How old is this game then? make it sound like this game is like 2020 or something <clears throat> I did have a look and um, when you go on the PlayStation store it uh, it sorts out games that are like the most downloaded to the least downloaded and this was quite up there morning exiles happy Monday this was quite up the top um, so people have been buying it I think just because it's in sale but again, I know nothing about this game. I hope it's voice acted. If not, I'm going to have to read. Uh, I've gone through the settings and I've taken a look and I've changed a few things. But apart from that, should I just hit go? This is called Dredge. I don't know if my camera's in the wrong place. I might have to move it. Hey, F Stefan. Stephanie, sorry. Stefan. Stephanie. Happy Monday. <clears throat> Let's just hit start and see what happens. I hope there's voice acting. I really don't want to read to you guys today, <laughs> if possible. I've turned off the reflection in the water just because it said performance is better. So I just turned that off. I don't need to see my reflection in the water. <coughs> uh oh. Yeah, I think we're basically upgrading ships, upgrading rods, discovering new areas. I don't think there's going to be voice acting. We would have heard some by now. But there is music. That's good. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. Oh. Yeah, I heard there's a few quests that the townspeople want. A short man in shouting or is shouting orders at a handful of workers and disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Great Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. So this is not where I live then. We've just washed up here. 
Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah oh, well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. This is an old man. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to our old vessel. To one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out of here to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. <coughs> Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Okay, there's the time. It's six in the morning. Undock. Triangle. This must be all my storage. So we've got enough for a fishing pole. And we've got an engine. Catch fish for the day. There's the map. There's the encyclopedia. There's messages. The mayor asked me to catch as many fish as I can then head back to the Great Marrow. Okay, so we've got to go fishing. Should we go? Undock. Circle. Forward. Okay. Rotate the camera, adjust height with R. So, there's some fish here. What is. Oh, this is the light. Fish. Start fishing. Oh. Okay, I need to move my camera. <laughs> One sec, guys. Let me just move my camera up. We need to be in the top corner. It looks like my head was right where I needed to be. Uh, start fishing. Uh, uh, uh. Rotate, discard, keep. Okay, so this is our storage. How do we, oh, we rotate like this. Hey Poppins, thanks for showing the love. <laughs> uh, do we just restart and go again? I forgot to press square. I was pressing X. Look. He just said to catch as many as possible, right? <clears throat> oh. Thanks, Poppins. We've missed you. I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on. Let's leave. We've also got to keep an eye on the time, and that time is flying by. What's this? Inspect. A floating buoy serves to mark pass safe passage. <clears throat> oh, okay. So it gives us light too. Fish. Disturbed water. Oh, we don't have the right equipment for that. What about this one? Start fishing. Oh, a new big one. It's a chunky boy. Oh, does it? Oh, you're right. That's good. See, that's what I need to know, Karen. Things like that, so I can chill out if the if if there's writing on the page. Lurk away, Poppins. I'll still be here. How was Snow Runner? How was Snow Runner exiled? What did you think? I can't imagine you playing a game. Um. <laughs> based on transport and goods from across the country. Uh, it looks like we shouldn't really go in the deep waters. I'm imagining this is not going to let me do it because my gear is not great. Yeah, see? Okay, so that was common sense. But it does look like I can go over these shallow waters. Wait, what's that over there? There is literally shark in this water. This looks very pretty. How do I get rid of this? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. I was going to say, how the f hell do I get rid of this? Oh, my bloody camera's there now, and I don't even know what I just picked up. I will figure out where to put this camera. Okay, we cannot fish anywhere over here. We need to upgrade our gear. Yeah, that just said that. Time only advances when you're not fishing. <clears throat> Can't fish you. 
I guess all we can do really is just fish this these couple of spots and it is the beginning so I guess doing this is going to get me some money I got stuck in the first five minutes so I tried three times <laughs> it didn't go well then by the sounds of it uh, oh we depleted it damn there's no more there select your light by holding L1 and toggle it with square oh here it is look <laughs> I love that there's an echo wait who's beeping me back okay I got a trophy uh, lights where was my lights here Here's my lights. Okay, we should head back. He said not to go out too far before dark, and it's now 18.59. I wonder if I can slow down time. You know when we could do it on... Um, oh, did I not hit the right area? I wonder if we could do... We could slow time down. I hate it when I'm... When I have to go quick on time. You step onto the dock at Great Maori. The mayor is waiting nearby. I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel, yours to own. <coughs> okay, so he's given us a loan. Uh, and he wants to make it easy for us. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn keeping the uh, population fed and satisfied. <clears throat> off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. So there's the fishmonger. So we don't get to walk through town, which is cool. That's my storage. You went to a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. I heard, you know, that my friend is a fisherman back home. And I heard that it's the most dangerous job in the world. That's in front of bomb disposal. You know, compared to the deaths of fishermen, like they're up there. <clears throat> I couldn't imagine being a fisherman and going out to sea in that big blue ocean. No way. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you to f for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just, just worth more too. He said fresher. That means that I can't be out for too long. Other towns on the other islands may pay you different, but while you're still, while while you've still got a debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you work off paying it first. So let's see what you've got. Okay, so these are the things that I can sell. How much are you worth? Seventeen dollar. Uh, why would I need a storage? What's the point in holding fish for storage? Sell. I mean, I guess I should sell it all. My head is in the way of something else now. Maybe I should go at the bottom. I mean, we should just sell everything, right? Have I paid my debt? Mary is standing outside the fisherman's store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here. I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you uh, could make something out of it. Why not? Why don't you take it? A curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment, but would need some investigation at a dock first. Pick up. And place. Here. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. She's up there, look. Why are you flashing? Research. As you walk in the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you. I'm not in the business of doing favours around here. Payment is up front and everything takes some time to install. How much money do I have? 
Okay, so she's saying not to go near any rocks because you will get damaged. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair a number of wooden boards all well above the waterline are splintered and scratched. The bigger the equipment the longer it takes to install. I don't have anything that needs installing. That's a, I've got seventy-four dollars. Yeah, I can't afford anything that she has. I might choose seventy-five. Can't even afford that. <clears throat> can't afford you. She has upgrades to lights. Yeah, we can't have anything. What's repair mode? Does anything need repairing? No. Install time, two hours. <clears throat> okay, we can't do nothing up there. We need to research this. I did. I did try Paleo Pines, yeah. Is that the one with the dinosaurs? Mechanically assisted reels allows the catching of significantly larger... Yeah, I did. I did a couple of streams on that. It's definitely on uh, YouTube. Um, but we didn't do much with it, did we? Fish and speed, plus 50%. Oceanic. We need that. It's now available in the store. Okay, there's, there's better engines, look. More fishermen lines. We can't look at pots and nets yet. No, it's not that old. I think it was last year, wasn't it? I think it was last year. Uh, we can't go out. So where's the store? Where's the dock? Yeah. Yeah, we did a couple. It was, um, it was okay. God, that's 410 for that. We definitely need a new rod at some point, though, but we're going to have to save for it. There's also nowhere, really, that I can put my camera. Maybe right down the bottom. Uh, we should rest. <clears throat> what was with the red in the background? <clears throat> okay, let's go back out. Da -da -da -da, da -da -da. Literally, I have no upgrades. There was the horn. I wonder what the horn's for. I'm just going to blast it. Randomly blast it. Can I fish here? Nope. Music's pretty. Got a big one there. We just need to make some more money. Get that rod upgrade. Uh, oh, we've depleted it. Will you let me fish here? Nope. Let's go look down here. Let's go explore. <clears throat> I wonder if there's a boost anywhere. What does triangle do? Cabin. Morning on the second day of the honeymoon and f our first proper... Oh. Foxy the legs because struggling with them. Well, the vision is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know he will keep his hand on the wheel instead of the rod. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I wish this was voice acted. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's Riches was a good name. I think he was surprised of a picnic lunch. Yada yada yada. Okay. Encyclopedia. Okay, so we get. Wow. We get fish. There's a lot of areas. So you would go to Stella Basin, and then there's like crabs and stuff. Oh my god, there's 151 coastal, 
30 shallow, 55 uh, oceanic, 70 abyssal. Oh my god, there are so many fish in this game. 78 hadal, 88 mangrove, 94 volcanic, and 118. That can't be 118 different types of crab. Wow. Time is flying too. And this boat's not going very fast, so I imagine at some point it's going to give us a boost to be quicker. I guess we should just go look around, because it looks like I can't fish for much without that rod upgrade. Oh, I can here. How do you know? How am I supposed to know where I can and can't fish? Let's, let's just clear this out. We're not missing a trick. Good. Well, at least we've caught something. There's something over here. All that's left of the boat is an old husk. You put a you pull a little closer. Oh, there's some bits in here. Look, there's a ring. Oops. Is there a quicker way of doing this? Uh. Should we take... Wow, the wood. The wood takes three. Uh, yeah, I have enough space. I wonder if there's an auto sort for your storage on this game. Can we have a look at that? Look, time stops when I'm in here, which is great. Let's just sort you out. There's a weird one over there. Actually, you can go here. Found some stuff. I imagine that. I imagine that ring is sellable. There's something over here flashing. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes. Can you focus on them? The cold stone does not respond to your touch. Okay, well that's something we need to come back to. It's not flashing for no reason can't fish here. I'm going to get a new fishing rod. That should allow me to fish a bit more. That looks like it's breakable. Those rocks. <coughs> Pile of loose debris. Yeah, I thought so. Looks very breakable. I wonder if there's a world map somewhere around. Oh look, there's an island over there. I actually think that island over there is part of DLC that I just got. Um, I managed to get a key from the DLC and I think it unlocks... Uh oh. Uh, we need the light on. This. I think it unlocks uh, the house that gives me stuff that I can use. Uh, where's base? I'm not, I'm not stopping. Oh my god, it gets really dark. Oh, here we are turn baby. Exposure to fog and other things increases your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Well, how do I stop it? Do I get near this light? This light did nothing. We need to get back quickly. I have fish for you mister. Uh, if you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal price. Tell me about the order. They asked for one gold flounder and one grey eel. I don't think I've caught any eel yet. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that for you. Do I sell things like this? Oh, I can't sell this. That should go to storage. Sell. He's just the fisherman, so he's not buying anything other than fish storage storage I wonder if it's in storage if I can still use it <coughs> mm, storage can I I 
Hi Rachel. Happy uh, Monday. How's it going, love? You alright? We're just fishing today. We're chilling and fishing. I wonder if that pops up anywhere. Right. How much money have I got? 118. So I can afford at least this fishing rod for shallow waters. Install. Can I put there? And then this one, I guess, can go to storage. Sell. No, we can sell this. I'm very well, thanks. Yeah, no problems here, love. All good. It's Bank Holiday Monday, isn't it? Hence why I'm here. How do I move this? Uninstall. Let me put you... Oh, you actually can't go down there. Okay. That only takes two seconds to install, so that's fine. I don't know what to do with these things. Not yet. Don't know what to do with these things. We can't buy anything like this. Mind you, we're only 20... We're only $20 away from our first onboard engine. A haunched woman approaches you from the steps of the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? Uh, I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favour and move on. She's rude. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. Very rude. So, Maya. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? I need to go east. Where be east? The mayor hands you a small pack, uh, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Okay, so he's basically going, you need to do that tomorrow. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Oh, I have a map. Where is this map? Don't have no map. <coughs> I do have a map. Oh, it's the X is there. Look. Oh, I can place a marker. I'm gonna place a marker right there. This is a big ass map. I also know that there's two. There's one DLC to this game that I already have. Okay, so that's our next destination tomorrow. Uh, we should sleep. Sleepy, sleepy. I actually think I actually found... Uh, excuse me. I found one of these too, didn't I? Spend one. I already have one. Flexible fishing pole. A hybrid design allows for a more flexible fishing style. Is that better than what I've got though? I have one. I should just use it. Oh, we need two of them. Got ya. Full sale. Okay, we've got our new fishing rod. We've got to deliver this package, so we should probably go now. Yeah, undock. We have to head east. So, where's my map again? Aha, we're, he we're heading that way. Good. So, whenever we leave, we're always heading east. I guess that makes sense because that's what the map says. Let's go get rid of this package. The mayor seemed to be very keen on making sure it gets done ASAP because it's fresh. <coughs> <coughs> On this little island. I have a little tugboat. I could do with a bit more speed. He tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. 
Let me hand you some money. Everything given to me is being hidden by my head. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get more use out of it. He's given me a book. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of pages are folded. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat. I know how lonely it can be. There's a trader there, though. <clears throat> are you connected to my storage by any chance? <clears throat> I specialise in antiques and jewellery. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. If you've got anything nice with you... I do, and it's in my storage. Sell. Hopefully I'm supposed to be selling this. Do I keep you, though? Yeah, we keep you. <clears throat> Undock. Okay, we've done one of them. We have a new rod, so let's see if there's something sparkly over there, though. I missed it. Go around again. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. What? Oh, this is big. Can we slot you in there? This is like Tetris. Tight. you there and leave. I'm gonna go see what this is. Looks like there's some debris over there too. Did I just hit my boat? Oh there's a message in a bottle. Okay I have a shallow rod so we have to stick with the shallows. I'm also intrigued with what's over here. The day goes so quickly I wonder if there is anything I can do to slow this time down a little deep. It's now raining too. I also need to keep an eye on what exactly the time is when it starts to get dark. That is going to be my the time that I keep an eye on the most. Horror? You're joking Exile. Are you serious? Where am I going? Oh yeah I'm, go I'm going back to base. I'm too scared. There's horror aspects. Are you sure? Great eel. Okay, we needed one of those. That was a quest. What should we do again? Uh oh. Well, I guess that's true because it said that if I didn't get better. Uh oh, it's now. Oh, look at the red in the background. Okay, now I can see. I can see the horror that you're talking about. Yeah, look at my eye as well. Can you see the eye in the just under the time? I'm not familiar with what all this is about. I guess we'll find out when we get deeper into the game. By the way, we had a follow yesterday. It was a sugar zack. Thanks, sugar zack. Uh, let's go and sell some fish. Uh, ah, they wanted these. Oh, is that not it? Bugger. Damn. I only have the eel, mate, right now. I don't have the place, though. Wait, you don't want to buy this? Discard. Why won't he sell it? Why doesn't he want to buy my goods? Oh, here. Uh, sell. Damn, we made 244. Okay, now we have money. Now we have money to spend. Ship's loan repayment. I only have $10 left to pay. Go to the ship, right? <clears throat> uh, repair all 30. Sure. I did bang it a bit. 
What's she selling now? She's got... Do I have this rod? I do. This is a shallow rod. This is a weighted line. Strength and line can catch larger and deeper fish. I think that's a downgrade to what I currently have. It's still time two hours. I don't know what that means. Coastal, oceanic, shallow, shallow. Should I get the weighted line? I guess we could have more than one rod, right? Install three hours. I don't understand what this install three hours means. That just took me three seconds, not three hours. I'm confused. Uh, I don't have enough money to do anything else really but sleep. We still need to get a couple of new engines. I don't know why there's two of the same thing in here. But never mind. Trawler net. I wish this ship turned a little bit better. I guess it is the first ship that we're going to have to upgrade, so... Uh, I really want to go over to that island real quick, because I think I have a key to the house. And I think it gives me something a bit better. I think it came with the game. Don't quote me on that. There's no way we're collecting those sharks. And we also need to find place or something. Some sort of flatfish to finish off that quest. <clears throat> I like living in remote places, but this is a little bit too remote. The workshop looks as though it hasn't been used in decades. Go inside. You enter taking a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. You find some horrifying creations amongst the detritus. Can I take these? This bony blade, the bony blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. Uh, yeah, we'll take that because it's free. symbol of the deep is carved in the small talisman it's sure to draw the attention of those attuned to it what I have no idea what that is the door is locked oh I don't have a key I obviously don't have a key I thought I had a key selected as an active book past time to read We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of a great and marrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and st struck the front of the boat. It did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around and a few items fell overboard in the water. Um, maybe there's some things in the water that I can go get. Selected as active book. Past time to read. Oh, that's what that guy gave us. So we caught, we caught a new fish there. Does this show us just two? Can we rest here? Dock, research. Nothing to research. Well, actually, didn't I pick something up just now? A 
Aberition bonus. What the hell is Aberition? Maybe it's something I'm not supposed to know just yet. Speed plus seven. So uh, I have a faster boat. I think. Are you sure I don't have a key to this? I thought it gives me a key. Undock. Am I faster? I think I am a little bit faster. I don't know. I don't know, I'm confused. Does anyone know where home is? I think it's this way, isn't it? I don't see where my speed is. It doesn't show me. Can we catch at least something today? I need some place, if possible. Aha, this is what I need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep going. <clears throat> God, there's nowhere I can put anything like this. I have no, I have no damage though. Let's go sell this. I wonder if because I sold the eel, I now can't finish the quest. Maybe I need to have both the eel and the place. Oh no, it keeps it for me. Well, you're not getting my gold one. You can take that one. Good, good. They should be pleased with this. I've got another order here. This one's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. So many people fish and squid these days, they only feed at night, and well, you know what nights are like around here, good luck. Wow. 169, I can buy... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this though. Maybe nothing. And this, I have no idea what this means. Aberration. Still got a couple of bits of stick. What even is this? Is this one of the same thing? 14 knots. 14 knots or 10 knots. Why would I want any of them? Unless by it you can have more than one and it gets quicker. Cracked bulb. 10 meters. 20 meters. We do need one of these. Let's get one. Uh, we need to read as well, don't we? So you actually stay, you don't leave. That was the gold flounder. We need to catch a grouper as well, but it doesn't even tell you the name, it just shows you the shape. How do I do this? Selected as active book, pastime to read. Oh, it says reading 26% completed. Does that go up for however long I stay on the island? or? If you're waiting to get a bit more out of your engines, take a look through this book on the house. She pulls a book from a toolbox nearby and hands it to you. Three of the pages are stuck together with grease. Nice. Uh, I don't need repair mode. Nothing's broken. She's given me a book. 
but I've only got $1.25 left to pay. That makes sense. So there's another book. 30% completed. Okay, so it looks like it just happens. Let's stick with this one first. Get this one done. <coughs> You got anything to tell me, our man? If you could have the information, it could have the information you need. It doesn't really. You got anything else to say? You want a variety of tackle to catch all the fish out there. Make sure you're prepared for whatever comes, whatever you come across. And Doc. I want to find some scraps and stuff. Do I have to select a rod? No, this is the only... This, hopefully we're using this rod, right? Can I just discard this? The shallow... They're both shallows, but one... I guess is better than the other, I'm not sure. How do I know which rod is better? Fishing speed is plus 10%. Oh, well there's no... We might as well sell this rod. Can I go back and just sell this rod? I don't need this two slot rod. Both do the, exactly the same thing. They're both shallow rods. Uh, oh no, yeah, I can sell it to you. So I guess it went in the storage, which means she can buy it back. You can buy it back at some point. Cool. Okay, now undock. <clears throat> I guess we need to stay in this area. We can only do the shallows though. So these deep ones we can't do. Hopefully this is shallow. It certainly looks shallow. Nope. This is shades of deep. Thanks for the follow, Invader. This is probably too deep. Too, oh, nope, it's not deep. I have no idea how this game tells me one thing is deep and one thing is not. Okay, that'll do for this fish. This fish is ruining me. I've not ventured past this yet. I also kind of want to see what happens at night. It says the squid come out at night, but I'm a bit scared. I don't know what happens at night in this game. There's some gold over there, look. Just take another one and let's get the hell out of here. I definitely feel like my boat's a bit quicker. What's this? Don't be stupid. Is that it? How do I not have... Stock low. Okay, we need a better rod. Also need to be careful of these cliffs. Watch this for skill. Look. Do you reckon, Invader? Do you like it? I'm having fun so far. I like the fact that there's like progression and story. We've not even got, we've not even got really to the story of this game yet. Uh, yeah, we don't need to be over here. There's nothing here for us. Let's head back home. I kind of want to see if I can get some squid from somewhere. This game is very pretty, by the way. I kind of want to be out at night just to see if there's any squiddies. Oh, you like fishing games? Then this is perfect for you, mate. This would be perfect for you. This is currently in sale, by the way. 
I'm just waiting for night time. It's currently in sale on the PlayStation. If you are a PlayStation player, it's on sale. If not, then I'm not sure. <clears throat> if, it's, if it's not PlayStation, I'm not sure. No problem. I like games where you get to upgrade stuff. There's something shiny around here. What's this? The lighthouse towers above. Waves craft crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. You ponder the intrinsic power of this structure. A vast column of stone shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until its decay into ruin, its purpose exhausted? The lighthouse towers above. I always wanted to live in a lighthouse. Did you know that? I always thought the idea was quite nice. Uh, I'm an idiot. I was kind of hoping for squid. Oh my god, it is so dark. I need to... <gasps> Whoa. Okay, so rocks jump up. Luckily I had my light on. Any squid? They say crazy things happen at night in this game. I don't see any more things. I'm too scared. Okay, so sustainable fishing is done. We better go click on the other book. My light just went out too. That's terrible. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what's going to go on at night, but uh, supposedly yeah, night time is the right time. That eye up there is annoying me. Sell. Don't overcommit yourself, especially when that sun starts going. I better come back with a small catch than not to come back at all. Sell. That's it. That's all we can do. The mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood with a spring in his step. Fantastic news. That's partly to your effort. Uh, Great Marrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facility. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishermonger services. We might have something to talk to, talk to you about soon. <clears throat> Keep up the good work. Also, we've got a dry dock now. So this must be more to do with the ship. <clears throat> Aha! We're talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. That's my that's my sort of upgrade. We'll need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. I do actually have lumber. Shipwrecks. Materials assigned towards upgrades. Here will be stored. Really? Oh, look. Modifies two cargo spaces to also hold rods. So this is what I need. The wood is one and the material is two. Modified four rod spaces to also hold nets. Why do I need so I have many engines and stuff though? Let me look at the end. That's four new cargo spaces to the hull. Hulls can sustain one additional impact. I'm not worried about that. Okay, so here's the upgrades to our boat. Beautiful. We've got $163. The skies were lit up with a weird crimson glow the other night. Yeah, I did see it actually. It was uh, scary. Nets have now shown up. 20 meters. I still have a light. Uh, we also need the book. We need to start on that too. I still have no idea what this does. The game's not explained anything to me reg regarding aberration bonus. Maybe that's further down the line. <coughs> uh, go back to the fishmonger quickly. <coughs> Abnormal specimens. Huh. Rest. I didn't find any cogs. 
Have you run into a photographer on your travels? She docked here a few days ago for supplies. I suggested that she take some pictures of the town for promotional purposes, but she didn't seem too interested. She mentioned she was heading south. Perhaps you should introduce yourself. Well, I shall head south too. So if that's where, if that's east, then I need to go this way. So she's probably going to be on one of those two islands over there. I already have been on this island. I don't know if she's going to be on this one or the other one. She's not here. She's not on this island. Can you undock, please? Maybe we'll try the other island. Surely she's not on this little one. Ooh. Stone hums quietly. I think we read about this before. So something's going to happen with that. We can fish here too. A spine broken with sharp angles and crooked curves, a row of teeth bent on revenge. Oh dear. The, that was really weird noise. Maybe she's further south than I thought. Maybe she's super south. I'm not going to stay here. Can we just continue to go south? Oh my god, she's not all the way over here. Hopefully I can stop on this island and sleep. Wait, what's this? Okay, we don't have the right spot for that. There's some weird stuff down there. There's so many fish in this game. <coughs> If I get all the way out here and I have to travel all the way back, look at the size of that marlin. There's definitely no way we're catching that. We're newbies. We're noobs. Is she gonna be here? Oh, there's some cargo in the water. Please let me get it. You pull up a wreck with a familiar looking hull, it's almost identical to the ship given to you by the mayor, except this one has a huge breach on one side. You're tied up alongside the old wreck. Check out the cargo. You poke through the cargo hold. A few items remain not yet lost to the sea. Definitely take the metal scraps. We need that. What's this? Valve engine. Well, we could sell it, right? Out of fault. You have to go in that slot. Are you kidding me? You have to go in here, though. Oh. Mission speed 35% coastal. I actually don't have a coastal rod. Should probably keep that. So what's this? Weak valve engine. This is really fast. It goes 18 knots. Storage. Oh yeah, I forgot I can stick stick in things in storage. Look in the cupboards and drawers. The cupboards have been completely and methodically emptied. All drawers are emptied. Try to find a loose call floorboard. There's no floorboards left. Check the overhead electrical equipment. A note slips off the top. You put it in your pocket to read later. Beautiful. I think we have cleared everything. Leave. Where's this woman? The time is now 5 p.m. And I still not find where this woman is. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. I'm in so much trouble. Uh, where's my map? Map. Can we get rid of you? No, 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 remove all. I need to get back here. 
quickly. So where is the... Oh my god. Oh, is that the lighthouse? Is that the lighthouse? Uh, we better put the light on. <clears throat> now this light goes off at some point, and I'm trying to figure out when. That eye is looking as well. Oh sweet Jesus. Okay, just keep going, little little tugboat. If I hear Jaws music, I'm turning it off. Keep going. I still need squid. I need to find squid. Oh my god, we're out so late. I knew I had no business going looking for this woman. Should I be going here? Yeah, I have no right to be there. Get back quickly. <gasps> Where the hell did these come from? These were never here before, surely. <clears throat> There's like a wreckage over there I never saw in the daytime. How funny. Stop the timer. Omar, you look exhausted. You're not forgetting to get some sleep, are you? As I always say, taking frequent breaks is an important part of being productive. Fishmonger. You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Now this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs his finger firmly along the length of the fish as though feeling for something. I did pick up a weird fish. He pushes from one side of its stomach and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open. From its stomach he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing and I'll pay you for the fish too of course. My head is covering some variety of things. I'll pay you well if you find any more. <clears throat> this was a corrupted fish. A once beautiful handkerchief drawn from the insides of a grotesque fish patterned with delicate crimson thread. What's it for? I have no fish. Oh yes I do. Sell. Why is that an X there? Uh oh we've disabled something. Oh we need to fix it. Do we need to fix it? Does this need to be fixed? We picked this up too. I think this engine is quicker than the one that I currently have. <coughs> 18 knots though. A notoriously unreliable design. It says it might have malfunctions though. 18 knots compared to 14 knots. I mean surely. Surely we should use the new one. Right. Pick up cargo place. Does this mean it gives me three hours of use? This has damage. My rod has damage. I need to fix that. I think this gives me seven extra knots. Yeah, we need to go see that woman. The man is looking at you through the cabin window. His face is mostly in shadows. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. There's another quest. Uh, we need you to fix, please. My rod is fixed. I don't know how the hell I broke my rod. Exit mode. 
What's this? Oh yeah, we need to send you to storage. I guess we can keep you. Just put you down here. I have $174. Nothing to buy. You don't have all the materials at once. You can store whatever you want right here at the dry dock. Modifies two cargo spaces to also hold rods. Modifies two cargo spaces to also hold engines. Let's hold lights. So we've got rods, nets, engines, lights. And I don't know which one to use. I don't know what nets do. go for it. What's this? Bolt of cloth and two lumber. Well we've got two lumber so we might as well use this. Two extra slots for a rod. Uh, for two, for extra rod. Now all we need is bolts of cloth. <clears throat> 80 percent completed. We caught a new barb deal. Oh yeah, we picked up a fisherman's note. <clears throat> deep sky, deep sky, deep forever. Casket seal broken, fog core. Five equals rise, he knows. What? <laughs> okay, that's going to be... We, we're going to need to translate that at some point. Uh, we've done two or four so far. A man approached me interested in what the fisherman pulled from the fish. wants to meet me at Blackstone Isle. I need to check my map for that just to see if it actually does say where it is. Ah, here it is. Okay, so let's get rid of this flag. This flag, to me, does not help because it doesn't show up on my map at all. If I put a flag there and go out to sea, it doesn't show me anything. What else is in my cargo? I guess we should leave. Yeah. I don't know where that woman is, neither. We have to try and head out and then head south. Is that what he said? Yeah. Wasn't I just over there? Wasn't I literally just here or is it further along the island? I'm definitely heading in the right direction. <coughs> I think it's this one. Yeah, that green flag doesn't show anywhere. Is he on this island? He is on this island. The man is standing in a doorway watching your approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. You came good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give the anger chief to the collector, he holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, the handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance. As you can imagine, retrieving them has proven to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. Ooh. Find me these lost relics and I will re reward you in ways beyond imagination. You need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary allocations. What do you say? I accept. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. The relics we're looking for are... Oh, I sold a ring. I sold one of the rings. A necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other uh, occurrences. Return when you have something. Well, that's not fair. I sold a ring. Did he actually give me anything for that? Did he... Oh, 
Okay, the ring is somewhere else, so it's not the ring that I sold. Good. Find the key in the marrows. So there's a key somewhere in the area that I am at. And then all the others have these. We still need to find two squids and one black grouper. And I imagine that they're both at night. Don't hit anything. Be careful. Does that woman show up on my map? Not messages. Pursuits. And we've done three of five. Actually, that woman doesn't show up anywhere. I'm going to head this way. Let's go around these sections, because there's things that we need to go look for. Shipwrecks and such. Correct, reading can put... Okay, so we just did another reading quest. We caught a nice yellow trout. Let's move on. Can we see any yellow glows? It's getting late, but I don't care. Oops. God, these are so big. Should have put that back. They're eels. There's a marlin there. I'm guessing there'd be a shape of a squid that I should look out for. Especially at night. Hopefully they're not big. Uh oh. What does red mean? What am I doing? I have no idea what I'm... Oh, I see what I'm doing. Well, that was close. Oh my god, this key is huge. Don't make me do that again. Uh, discard. To get rid of that, keep the key. Okay, we found something, and it was red, which means that things that are red are important. Oh, we need to go back. Where the hell is this lighthouse, man? Oh my god, that just popped up out of nowhere. Can we sort you out? No, we can't. I guess we've got a little bit of space. I don't think I have any business to be fishing right now. What is that noise? Oh my god. Where's the lighthouse? Can anyone see the lighthouse? That's the lighthouse. <sighs> this game is tripping. Just be wary of the rocks. There's rocks over here. They just pop up out of nowhere. <sighs> Is that the village? No, that's the village. And the light goes off too. What's that all about? Oh, you can just switch it back on. I didn't realise. Okay, we've got a key. We've got a key that was asked of us to find. <clears throat> Fisherman, what is it? You look a touch troubled. Is the fog starting to get to you? Is this game have like some sort of madness attached? Builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? It's tricky, mate. 
It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward. Moving along. She's gazing out to the sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. She says just to the north like it's literally a stone's throw away. I bet you it's like miles away. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You'd be welcome to visit too. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Okay, first of all, where is Steel Point? These are both completed. Oh, you're Steel Point. You're actually not that far away. Let's remove you. And let's stick a place marker here. And in fact, I'm not going to put a place marker because there's no point. It covers my X. There's some dots over here as well. So we caught a new eel. Numerous glowing shapes flicker and squirm behind a distended rib cage. And the pursuit is her two lumber and two scraps. Scraps are really big. Anyway. Sure, shipwrecks. Unfortunately, there have been quite a few in the recent years. The lighthouse helps, but even it struggles to cut through the fog at night. We do our best to salvage and clear any shipwrecks that occur around the island. Yeah. Around the back, though, it's a little harder to get to. There are still some wrecks towards the deeper patches. You'll want to avoid that area. Look at the time. How is time still ticking? The resort on the atoll, built on top of a beautiful coral reef. I'm sure there's a wide variety of fish there. Uh, mm. <coughs> Hello. What do you know about any strange occurrences? Well, I heard that my counterpart in Little Mara met at the most unfortunate end. They say he went quite mad suddenly. One day he was normal, the next he was pacing the shoreline, hurling people's belongings into the sea. After some days like this, he disappeared, never to be seen again. Okay, so there is... There is some sort of craziness. <coughs> oh no. Mm -mm. The last fisherman, oh, he was very unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, and proceed to sleep all day. He was also a terrible captain. I mean, te really terrible. Constantly running around on the uh, ground on the reef, even in broad daylight. Shan't be missed by us. Okay, let's leave you. Do you know any shipwrecks? She eyes you spit suspiciously. There's a spot near the back of Great Amaro where the current carries in wreckage from the sea. The back of Great Amaro. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from the patch of dark water. Was that the key I just got, maybe? So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. I see plenty of strange things from the top of the lighthouse. I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. She also eyes. Are you really standing here in front of me, or is it just another of the fog's tricks? Okay, she's crazy. They're talking about that island that I've been to quite a few times. Some nights I still think I can hear the hum of the engine sailing past the bay, but I know he's gone and I don't want to talk about it anymore. I'll leave you to it, lady. I should sleep. Quickly. And sell some fish. Okay, so he wants these sorts of fish, right? Damn, he gives you a lot of money for them too. Uh, and everything else we keep. Let's put you in storage, because you're too big. I can catch coastal shallow and dredge now at the moment. I don't know how I can catch dredge. How do I catch dredge? 
fishing speed 125%. Ah, oh, these are my stats. Okay. Maybe I should buy another light. A good one. 750. 20 meters. Uh, I'm going to sell you. This one's better. And then we'll go to the dry dock. Yeah, I have nothing else here to give to this lady. Um, pursuits. We can't do you. I guess we could go hand the key in. See what he gives us for the key that we just got. Yeah, that seems a good idea. Let's head back to the island. Uh, nope. Let's head back to the island, hand this key in. I don't think I need the key on me. I think it's already in my storage. <clears throat> I have a better light, which is wonderful. Not that we need it. That's going to do something, surely, at some point. I have a key for you, buddy. Oh no, don't say I need the key. Wait, the storage is here. Now, the storage. My storage. Maybe I need it on me. Aha! Still holding the Sylvan Crimson book? He seems impatient. Well, you have something, don't you? Show me. You hand in the key. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head. Now someone seems... Now someone, somehow, now somehow seems changed. Smaller. Has it always been this way? Is this all? Where is the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems the pieces we're looking for have travelled further than anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision and you stagger back briefly. Give me something good, please. Oh. Ability unlocked. Haste. My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris to the southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Make that your priority. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Uh, do you know who owned these relics? The book holds power from the deep by merely extending its power towards you. So in particular, is there one in particular you wish to know more about? Yeah, what does this haste do? The word of haste are instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engine. Oh, okay. I guess we should use haste. Unhastily. Uh, haste adds speed to your engine, but increases panic and engine heat. Select it with R1 and use it. Oh, so it's one of these, look. I'm scared. Oh, it does drop, though. I guess as long as we don't blast it up to the top, we should be fine. Let's look at this map. He just added something all the way up here. Okay. I think we can do that. Can I, can I fish here yet? I can. Oh, there's a ring. I forgot. We've got to dodge the blacks. Oh, it's a little horseshoe, look. Is that it? That's it. Start dredging, go. Whoa, that's too much. Sweet Jesus. Okay, we got some stuff anyway. 
Can I? Oh, another one. <gasps> I keep pressing up and down instead of square. <clears throat> oh wow, we got some um, stuff. Nice. Oh, there's more? Yeah, mate. We need two of these for that lady. Oh, these are so blocky. Uh, I don't even think I have space to get another one. Oh. Okay. Okay, we'll have to... Come back here another time. Is there wood here? How big are you? Nope, nope, nope. Metal scraps. We should head back. It's getting night. Oh, and we need a light on too. That's even worse. Oh, damn. We can't do both. Where even am I? <laughs> I have no idea where I am. No, no, no. There's a rock, Jamie. There's a rock, mate. What happens if I go near the eyes? Okay, there's a lighthouse. Let's just head back. We just got a really good haul of um, of bits, metal scraps and stuff, and horseshoes and things. The guy behind me can buy those. He's going to love them. Whoa, that was close. So now we have a haste ability. Beautiful. <clears throat> the lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Oh, it's you. Your engine, it sounds like. I'm sorry, I mistook it for the vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back to the lighthouse. She's a very mysterious lady. Um, I don't think I have any fish. I found this book out back. Could be useful to you. Good, we need a new book. The fishermonger reaches under the counter and hands you a damp, battered book of food. Shimmering fish scales are stuck to the covers. Eel. Uh, we have no fish to give to this man. Get this repaired. Okay, we need to repair something. Let's put you in storage. And you. And you. And you. We can leave this. Uh, I think we needed a dry cloth, didn't we? I think we can now unlock this extra rod, you know. Uh, storage. Here it is. Place. $95 to upgrade. Modifies two cargo spaces to also hold rods. Two rod spaces. I have no money. Oh look, new lights. Way better than the ones I've got. 1,825 meters. Yeah, like, they're way better. We need to save up for these. Not that I have two light spaces though. I've only got one. And I can't even repair because I'm poor. Someone give me some money. <clears throat> oh yeah, she wants me to... Why do you want to leave? It was once a bright and thriving little town, if you can believe it. There were plenty of work for me and my crew. New houses and shops every other month. We made a fair bit of money out of it too. But I don't know, I guess the bubble bursts or something. I don't know how these things work. People started leaving, my crew left, I stayed. We should sleep. <clears throat> so that haste is going to be good for daytime only, not nighttime. Nighttime, it's going to be no good to us at all. Uh, we should go sell these. There's some metal here, someone will pay for that. Doesn't say to sell it. Engraved, but also. Almost every detail is entirely worn away. Bronze belt buckle. Let's 
start reading. Mods doesn't make sense. So it doesn't tell you what you get out of it. Oh, yes, it does. 10% chance to not reduce fish stock. Engine provides 5% more movement speed. I wonder what this is going to give us. We have got another fishing rod slot, which is nice, but it's a chunky one. It's a weird one. And I can't afford to fix what I've broken. I would really like to try and do get those two lumbers or two scraps put in where that lady is. Where's the map? <clears throat> I'm sure I could reach that. Place marker. God, it's so fat. Oh, you can actually zoom in too. Okay, I'm going to try and get that with my boost. Uh, L1. Down here. Go. Without blowing up the engine though. I wish there was a mini-map somewhere. Why was it so red? Am I heading in the right way? Nope, I'm heading in totally the wrong way. Turn around little boat. Right this way. Did you see the sky went all red and stuff? When my engine... <coughs> is nearly dead. I got a trophy for that. <laughs> okay, she's quite a distance. She's over here though. She's just around this corner. <clears throat> I'm guessing she's going to be here. Okay. Go back. Damn, there's no storage. There's no storage box. I did this for nothing. At least we can sleep. <clears throat> I didn't think I'd have to bring it with me. Lady. I might as well fish then. Mind you, there might be some lumber here that we can get. There's definitely uh, a boat that sank here. Uh, yeah, we definitely need this. We can give this to her right away, actually. We actually have all the uh, stuff that she needs then. We just don't have the bits with us. Uh, go. Oh wow, this is quick. Nice little goblet. The spot's been depleted. I guess we can rest actually where she is. We don't need to go back home. We are quite far away. <clears throat> this has some good little spots. I like this game a lot. This game is very... Oh, there's scraps too. I wonder if we can fix this in a sort of way that will give us all we can. Good, because if we get another bit of scrap, then that's all we need. Uh, we can drop you down here. God, I feel like I'm playing... Um, Resident Evil 4. Go. Nice. We've got everything she requires. Is there anything else we can do? There's another scrap. We don't have the space for this. Let's head back to where she is. My little light's on. Do I have a little light on? No, I don't. Where's my light? Nope. That's better. We, we should rest here. 
for the night. Material pile. Let's give her this. I wonder what she's going to give us. Maybe we have to head back home to tell her. At least we don't have to be back home to rest. It's even on the zoom. You should let the builder know. Should I be heading out just to see if I can at least try and find some squid? Is there any squid around here? Is, is this too deep? Nope. This is a new fish. Ooh. Do more. I guess tomorrow it just means I'm going to have to head back with a full ass boat of fish. Okay, now we should rest. We should just rest. It's getting pretty late. My boat's full. The hell was that? That was a good day. And now we have to head back home. Oh no we don't, actually. Oh shit, we do. Mm, no we don't. Oh, we can't put it in our thing. Return to the builder. Yeah, we're not home, so I don't get my um, my storage box, unfortunately. That's the only downside to staying somewhere that's not home. Is lack of storage box. <clears throat> Go speak to the builder. Go tell her the great news. I wonder what happens if you actually blow your engine up. I guess you just need to fix it again. No fishing. No space for fishing. Hey Lava Tick, happy Monday. You're not at work, are you? Uh, let's get rid of these fish first. I do. Just leave whatever you have here. I'll keep the order on ice until you uh, until it's all ready. Well, I didn't know that you. Oh, so we got one of these. Okay, so we just need to find those squiddies. The rest can be sold. Thirty dollars. Uh, we have a lot to go sell to that guy too, and we also need to fix this. Lucky. Lucky, lucky. I'm at work tomorrow, unfortunately. The builder is there, look. Hopefully she gives us money, because I'm poor. Let's get moving. Oh, I need to bring her... Up. She wants me to take her too. Lady, you owe me money. Um, shipwright. We need to fix, fix me, please. Thank you. Exit that mode. Yeah, she's not buying anything, but I'm going to have to sell all of these goodies that I've got along the way. Um, but they're all in different directions. She's at one direction. The guy who buys these weird things are in is in another direction. I guess this won't hurt. To have one slot filled. Let's get you down here. Uh, in fact, let's put you here. I need to sell all these things to him. That's going to get me some more money. I think we should head out now. Is there anything else in here? No, everything's fixed. Ferry builder to steel point. Let me think. Where's the guy? Where's the guy that buys things? Is he over here? Yeah, he is. He's over there. Okay, let's undock. 
Let's go free up some of this stuff by selling <coughs> items quickly. I'm never going to blow this engine up. I'm too careful. Yeah, hey, Lobotic. Um, what are you up to today, then? Are you going to be playing any games? Do I have some stuff to sell? Trader. Oh, the storage is here, too. That's nice. So I actually don't have to have it on me. There's a grieving father that wants to talk. But before I do that, let's sell. Hopefully, I don't need these bloody items. 145. Wasn't there one more thing? No. I think when I press square it sold everything. Sell all trinkets, yeah. Okay, so let's go talk to this guy down here. Well, yes, you see. My only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks all alone in the cold dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grease ra grief racks his body. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think you'd feel more at peace. Don't tell me it's a belt buckle and a goblet. Oh my god. Oh my god. I knew I weren't supposed to sell that. That literally said, do not sell me. God, I'd love to just start again. <gasps> oh no. Okay, so um, uh, thank God. So is the game is saying I just sold it to <laughs> to the trader. <sighs> the man hurries away towards the trader. Do I not get anything for that? I'm so stupid. Oh, he's giving me something. He pulls a book from a stack, sitting on his desk and hands it to you. It's covered in dust, but otherwise seems in good condition. I am not selling things unless it says it will fetch a price any more. Why did I do that? Have you got anything to say, dock, uh, dock worker? Supposedly some 20 odd years after ago, uh, a fisherman from these parts hauled up an old sealed casket from the seafloor. They pried it open and took what was inside for themselves. The very night the fog rolled in for the first time and it has cloaked the sea ever since. What was in the acu uh, accursed casket, no one knows. All of the crew that laid eyes on, it, uh, on its contents went mad or worse. Okay, so the fog is crazy. Uh, what is the painter? <coughs> I had thought she might stop by. Welcome to my humble humble studio. If you're wanting to experiment with some decorations, yes, I'm the person to talk to. I can attach flags and buntings to add some style to your boat. I have a design here already that you might like. If you find any others on your travel, bring them back to me and I can rig them up for you. Oh, so he upgrades boats. Well, he makes them look pretty. can also add a new splash of colour to your hull. I'm sorry to say that my selection of pigments limited at the moment, though. Hmm... I will help you find more pigments. <clears throat> the other day down by the shoreline I saw a strange crab with the most strikingly vibrant coloration. My knees aren't suited to clambering over rocks and chasing crustaceans you see but if you caught such a creature, he clears scraps of cloth and paper from his workbench revealing a large pestle and mortar. Welcome back Lobotic. With the right binding agent we can grind them together for a new mixture. He turns back to you a cunning plan formed in his mind. Fisherman, bring me some of those strange crabs. We'll turn your vessel into a work of art. But uh, for now, what can I help you with today? Deliver flag? I don't have a flag. I didn't think I did. Paint boat. Roof. Rusty red. Sharp mint. <clears throat> You'll need to bring me these crabs. Oh wow, there's two big ones. Malignant pincer and a cerebral crab. Mm. Blue. Let's look. Mm. Nice, we've got a nice little blue. Uh, the hull. Should we do blue depths? Mm. 
Okay, that didn't look like anything, but cool. Back. So he will paint my stuff. Uh, yes, I do actually. I prefer this game more than Dave the Diver. I love the name Dave the Diver. What's bunting? Oh, I know what that is. Leave. Uh, we need to go drop this lady off as well. No, I prefer this to Dave the Diver for sure. Dave the Diver was fun though. I only played it once, but it definitely left its mark on me. Am I heading the right way? Uh, let's wait until this is done. I am. Go. But the, the Dave the Diver and this are two completely different games, you know what I mean? This is more of an exploration. And although Dave the Diver is kind of like that too, uh, underwater, um, I prefer this. I actually have not done any fishing today. Oh, there's a ring. Okay, do not sell anything anymore unless the game says it can fetch a high price. We've got some pearl earrings there. Uh, we need our light back on before things get weird. Luckily, she's literally here. We can chuck her out. He didn't. I um, I liked, I liked the funniness of it. You know, this will do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back any time. I'm looking to see what she gives me and my head's in the way. She reaches into a toolbox and pulls out a handful of components. Take these. Always good to have on hand. Oh, she's giving me a couple. Look, research parts. Uh, horror specific. I am not very good with horror, but I do like playing... Uh, well, I've not played it for a good while, but I did enjoy playing um, Resident Evil 2 Remake. I was a mess. I should play that again sometime. That's a fun ass game. But I, I was a mess. <clears throat> Resident Evil 2 Remake is such a beautiful game. But I, I don't really do horror. I think yesterday was the first time I ever played, or on stream at least, a, um, a, a, a sci fi game. Sci fi game was yesterday. Uh, I have two research parts. I think maybe we should start thinking about a new engine, maybe? We can't do nets or pots yet. Use parts to research new equipment. Volcanic and shallow, or mangrove and coastal. Coastal, shallow, mangrove, volcanic. I mean, do you wait to get four? That that only takes one. Imagine at some point one of these rods is going to cover all all sections. Do am I looking for speed? Is it rods that I really need to look at? Volcanic and shallow or mangrove and coastal. I think this one. This is oceanic. This is coastal and shallow. Where is mangrove? Do I even need mangrove? I think we should just look at, at this right now. I don't want to improve. I want to unlock. It's 15 knots though. Oh, so I had to do that to unlock the other two. High quality, 26 knots, 36 knots. That's much quicker. This engine is outfitted with a dual propeller, but that's going to take three of them. Um, I think we should look at this one. It's four squares, but so is this. Let's just stick you in there and move on with our lives. How is my... Do you say it's going to fetch a pair of rooms, each holding a single pearl? Okay, so this one doesn't say to sell it. So I might 
keep this for now. And it is a new day. <coughs> uh, undock. We didn't get to check all around here. I'm going to store all this. So I imagine at some point we're going to need quite a few of these. Let's put you over in this corner. This spot's been depleted. Yeah, it looks like around here there's a lot of um, items that we can get. More scrap. We need this for our dry dock hull and stuff. What it was like. Thanks, Lobotic. Have a good one, yeah? Enjoy the rest of your free days. Always a pleasure to see you, love. There's a lot of scrap here. I want it. I want as much scrap as possible. I just made that harder than it needed to be. The problem is, there's not much else I can grab. That's the problem. Uh, let's put my little boost on. And head back home and drop these off. Let's see if I can catch a couple of fish. There's the lighthouse. You're a two. We'll grab you anyway. We can, we can do that. Let's go home with at least something. Let's go home with at least one fish. I need more storage. And we can go dump some stuff off in here. Um, I don't see the point in the nets right now. Stick you in there. I've got no planks of wood. Oh, you're not this. Okay. I'll put you back then. You both can go in here. We might as well store this in here, hey. Can only help. You're like a three. This is lumber. Oh, we didn't get any lumber. <clears throat> Aha, but we did get two of these. We've got those pale earrings. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with those. I don't know. I tend to sell them and then bloody make a mistake. Put you down there. In fact, no, let's put you up here. <clears throat> Shit, right, dry docks. Shit, right. Oh, I still have two of these in storage as well. Do I need you? 14.7 knots. Can I sell? Yeah, I don't need that other one. I'm not sure if they stack, if engines stack, if I put them in my actual cargo. I don't know. My current engine is a little bit faster, but it does take up four slots. That'd be the problem. 
or three slots, should I say? 18.9. Two hundred and seventy-five. <clears throat> They've got nothing they want to say to me. She talked about the fog. Okay, we need to protect the lighthouse at all costs. Uh, we need to start reading you. We need to keep on top of these. Because uh, that just gave us a 10% chance to not... No, it didn't. Rods will reel fish in 10% more effectively. So these books actually do have stats to them once read. So make sure we keep on top of that. We've done four out of... No, we've done five quests out of seven. Still haven't managed to find those arrow squids. But we did find a black grouper that we stuck in. The relics is one done. These other ones we're nowhere near getting to the other side yet. I'm a bit scared to. Deep sky, deep sky, deep forever. I don't know what any of that shite means. Uh, sleep. I guess we should end it here. We've got through day 11 in two hours. I like this game. I think I'm going to make a section of it on YouTube as well. Because I'm interested to see what's out there. And there's so many fish to catch. There must be two, three hundred fish in this game. And it's given me very much those old vibes of games. You know, where it would say, do you wish to enter this house? But I like stuff like that. So we'll play this again. <clears throat> this will be on my list to play again for sure. Uh, this won't go in my odds and sods folder. I'll make a special one for this because this is a good game. Um, I'll be back tomorrow after work. So 7pm UK time GMT. If you're watching on YouTube, thanks for watching. Subscribe. And uh, see you all tomorrow. See you guys. Have a good rest of your day.